a developing story. The family of a man murdered while walking his dog is speaking out as the search for his killer continues. Surveillance cameras capture the husband and father being gunned down in a street in Mid-City. As Eyewitness News reporter Amy Powell shows us, there is a growing memorial where he died. An emotional vigil in the neighborhood where a father was killed while walking his dog. His wife, daughters, and other family members embracing each other, devastated by the death of 52-year-old Marcos Sandoval. Neighborhood residents coming out to pay their respects. I'm so sorry for this. Sandoval's family grateful for their support. It means a lot. Means there's still people out there that... Have a heart. The family describes Sandoval as a hard worker who had no enemies. He was walking his dog early Saturday morning when he was confronted at the intersection of Genesee and Saturn. A home surveillance camera capturing a dark colored car driving along the street and stopping. Police say the gunman got out of the vehicle, exchanged words with Sandoval, and then opened fire, killing him. Sandoval's dog can be seen running away, the agitated pet returning to the family's home. The suspect fled. The murder happened in a neighborhood where many residents walk their dogs. Many say they used to feel safe in the community, but now they're worried. Whoa. It makes you scared to leave your own house in your neighborhood. This neighborhood is so quiet, I never heard nothing bad about it. The family is desperate for answers, hoping someone has information that will help police find Sandoval's killer. Right now the whole family is, is heartbroken, and I really, really appreciate that you guys are supporting them. I really do. The family has started a GoFundMe account raising money to transport Sandoval's body to Mexico for burial.